as as I was exiting, we just had this great little, you know, wrap up here uh, about, you know, this is so gorgeous and so much a home and you have seen other people's. And I know this seems to me like something that you're not going to be looking to switch up in a couple years. Tell me, I know you're passionate about this. Yeah, no, this is this is my home. I I built it just the way I wanted it, and I really was I really wanted to make it feel like I was living in a home and not living in a bus. Mm -hmm. And so I really put in the time and the energy and the blood, sweat, and tears and money to make sure that this is kind of a you know, maybe not forever home, but definitely a home for a long time. Yeah, and you didn't rush the process. No, I really took my time to make sure that everything was the way I wanted it. Yes, yes. And when yeah. you're young and you have the, you know, you have that drive and you're still working, but you have an end goal, mm -hmm. which to me is really, really cool. Yeah. But your end goal is really just a beginning for you. It's a right. new, it's a new chapter and a new day. Yeah. Definitely. So, yeah. So thank you. I mean, I love the walkways. You've got your art studio. You've got your bed with a view. Yeah. You've got, you don't have, you don't poop in a bucket. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it is, and you've got a full stove. You yeah. can cook everything. So I just, I wish you all the best. Well, thank you very yeah. much. we're back thank Hi. you for having us yeah of course and, and do you have a name um for her yes her name is tawanda from fried green tomatoes women empowerment oh my gosh girl <laughs> now i know why i liked you that's my of all time i love it yeah it's a good one okay so what do we got going on here in tawanda uh, yeah so um front here i have my sweet little library and um the books have never fallen here this rope has really done great um, I put up my baskets. I learned uh, recently how to make these baskets. Ooh, so these they're are beautiful. My own. Thank you very much. Yeah, so they've been really fun. A great project for being on the road. Yes, um, that's and, something you could sell right in Quartzsite. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, I think it would be fun to sell them. And then um, Aston Martin's little bed over here, that's when I'm parked, he likes to sleep in there. All right, he's got his special yeah, place. Yeah, yeah. And then if you look in here, this is kind of my garage since I have my art studio in the back. That's all, all my right. tools and... How far back does that go? Uh, quite a ways, and then it goes all the way forward a ways, too. Oh, and very cool. all the way to the top, too, so it's stacked in there pretty good. Love it. Yeah. All right. And then... Um, Let's see, my tile backsplash, that was all my own artwork, my tiles. That is beautiful. What Thank kind of you. painting is that? Uh, it's alcohol inks on tile, and then I put a resin coating over it. <sighs> yeah, I was I'm fun. telling you, girl, <laughs> telling you. And let, that's right. We got to remember, too, at the beginning here that you built this all out. Right, yeah. At I your dad's everything. in yeah. his backyard mm -hmm. in Colorado for yep. a year. Yep. Learning off of YouTube. Yeah. Okay, what do we got here? Uh, this is my stove oven range combo. It's a gray stone. Um, and I actually got a discount on it because they ordered one with a dent on it. And so that was a great way to save a little money. Wow, is gray stone the brand? Yep, gray stone's the brand. Um, and nice little, wow. you know, I, I make brownies and all sorts of fun stuff in there. All right. Yeah, all right, right girl. Stove. And all then right. I just have this bubble wrap there just to keep it from rattling around okay. when I drive. That's a good tip. Yeah. And, um, oh, my propane tank is here in this sealed box. All right. Right here. So it's, um, vented through the bottom as well so it's nice and safe for me and it runs your stove what else my hot water heater um which is under in this cubby uh, my hot water heater and my baking dishes and um and that's it all right yep and then on this side i have um uh, my bathroom with my shower and composting mm -hmm. toilet all right Come so we're through. gonna get in your face there yeah that's fine there we go all right, nice shower. Yeah, yeah. yeah and you did I, all this. I did it all. Yep. Are you serious? <laughs> like you did the the walls. Yeah, and the... I. It's just that uh, FRP board and FRP board. Yeah, I think that's what it was called. FRP. All right. Wow. Um, but yeah, it's just a show. Totally waterproof in there. So. Wow, I'm yeah. impressed. Thanks. And then look how cute this is. Yeah, little... my little spice rack, and it's great. I've held on to it for years and years. Knew I wanted to do something with it eventually, and so you and brought your little home life yeah. into your home here. Yeah, very nice. And All right, we'll continue on down um, here. And then I've got food storage in here, plates and pans, and food storage. Very good. 
Yeah. Um, and then organized girl. Pull out extra counter space. Yes. Great 12 volt fridge. I love that one so much. Hobalt. Uh, 12 volt. Oh, 12 volt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I was thinking of a brand again. Oh no, no 12 volt. So, um, how big so, is it? It's, it's a decent size. My freezer. It sure I, is. I hate how small my freezer is, but the, uh, the fridge itself. Oh, I love that. Space. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I yep. see the sink covering. Yep, my sink cover and nice big deep sink. I wanted something that I can, I do a lot of cooking, so I wanted to make sure that I had a deep sink that I could wash my dishes in. And what kind of favorite dishes do you make um, on the road? I, I am plant-based, so I do a lot with tofu um, and uh, veggies. I love veggies, stir fries, that kind of stuff. Um, yeah. Wow, a lot of healthy stuff yeah, for yeah. a healthy girl. Yeah. Healthy in nature and healthy in body. Yeah. And then my little seating nook here, and I've got more pots and pans up here. All right, um, and don't be shy about telling us how you built this a, a little okay. if you have any details yeah, about um, The cabinets themselves I actually ripped out of a uh, RV that was getting ready to go to the dump and so I just ripped them out and put them in here and it, they were great. Well you didn't like glue them to the walls with <laughs> Elmer's glue. <laughs> no, this is amazing no, to me. No. How do you fasten those? Um, they actually have metal bars right here up at the top and so then they had holes that I drilled in. Uh, the whole thing is furred out underneath the walls and so I just drew, drilled them into my furring. Oh tips. yeah, just, yeah, just yeah. a little project. Yeah, yeah this uh, is amazing to me. Thanks. And then I, I do have two inches of wool insulation in the ceiling, the walls, and the floor. Two, in, ten, two inches of wool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep, wool insulation. Very so good. it stays nice and warm in here. All cool. right. And um, what do you use for your, uh, for heat? I have a diesel heater here. All right. And I've been uh, seeing quite a few of these. Yeah, I love it. It's super nice. It was just one of the cheap ch Chinese diesel heaters. I think I got it for under a hundred bucks. Okay. Um, the tank is actually on the outside. It's got its own little box that I built uh -huh. for it. Yep. Uh, that way I don't get any diesel smell inside. And it's right next to, since this is a diesel, it's right next to my fill. So it's easy to fill both of them at the same time. Wow. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. And then how was this built? Uh, this, this is just a little seating area. It's yep. not a bed. Nope. It's just a seating area, but it does slide out. Oh, yeah. And so it's just built with the slats there. And then I can take these cushions and put them down, pull both sides out, and turn it into a big lounge area. You know what? I am so impressed with this because oftentimes, <laughs> like, you'll see fancy class A's or B's and they've got these straight up couches. And I'm like, who like, yeah. who sits like that? No, I like to lounge. Yeah, and to spread yeah. out. And you can go sideways, you can go straight mm -hmm. out. Yeah. You can make somebody really comfortable there. Yeah, and yeah. it's small enough that if I had a guest, I could curl up on this and sleep and let somebody uh, Oh yeah, I'm all about curling up, yeah, yeah. yeah. So Very nice. All right, and any um, more of your artwork here? Um, no, other than I put the rose quartz together. Those were from a rock uh, shop in Colorado. Oh, and beautiful. Then, yeah, I built them, glued them onto the pegs. So wow. That was a fun one. All and right. then this actually was a piece that I cut and put epoxy on, and it's a little, sweet little light. Oh! Yeah. Check it out. Check it out. Yeah, so Ambiance. Let me see what that is. What is that? Uh, it's just my plug. It's my, um, not a very super well built, but since those plugs are so thick, I had to find a way that I could just cover the plug itself. So, no, and I then think it's that's pretty dang awesome. And then it's, you put this. Yeah, it's just a plexiglass. And then I took the framing and framed it out. And then this is just that window stick, stick on window film. And I put it on both sides. And when the sun goes through there, it's really nice. It gives me the the rainbow patterns everywhere. It's Artist beautiful. extraordinaire here, yeah. girl. You can see your touches of artistry all <laughs> over the place. Thank you. Yeah. All right. And then the and, floor here. Uh, yeah, but this was, um, it's, I have two different colors here because I got I this, like it, though. the dark for free from uh, one of my dad's friends. Ooh, and free so, is good. Yeah, but he didn't have enough to do the whole floor, but I really wanted to do this light gray in the front. Uh-huh, very I nice. I just loved it, so. Um, Love your colors. Thank yes. you, yeah. Yes. The paint color is called Bon Voyage. <sighs> Wow, I love paint colors. Well, wow. and you've got a little fan up yeah, here. That's the 10 speed. It's got the cover so it can be on when it's raining. 
and I love it. Um, I have the skylight above my bed, so when it gets hot in here, I'll turn that on and open my skylight, and I get a really nice cross. And breeze. you put your fan in. Yep. I you did everything. Yeah. Everything means everything. Yeah. Yes. Let's see. Uh, my dad did help me cut the holes for these two things. All right, let's give was... dad credit where credit's yeah. due because yep. he's going to be watching yeah. this. <laughs> you can say, hey, dad. So, yeah. <laughs> um, all right, and what's in here? This is my closet. Uh huh. And so I've got all my clothes here. Yes, yes. You're and a teal girl of yes, sorts. Yes, and grays, my <laughs> color. Sure. I love these colors. And then, um, excuse me, Lindsay, we talked about boys in the last yeah, one. Yeah. So this uh, is your boy here. Yeah, these are my boys. Uh, my mom got me this for Christmas. It's the uh, Australian firefighters posing with cute little baby animals. Okay, so. all right. Well, maybe she's on the same train as me. Yeah. This is your men right here. Yeah, this is my men. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. Yeah, if you want to see more. Come meet Lindsay. Yeah. We'll and flip it in ve in February. If you like that, then I got something else special for you here. Oh, you got something special yeah. going on. I wonder what this is. As long as it's G here now. <laughs> Here's uh, my cooking apron. Oh, we got to put it on. Yeah. With, oh, uh, yeah. With my yeah. men there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> These are my kind of men, guys. Yes. Yes. Country boys. Whoa, that's <laughs> awesome. I love it. Thank that's you. Thrift store find. Yeah, yep. a gift for all of us. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. All right, so back to your yep. bed area. Yeah, so I've got here, I've got um, silverware, cups, and mm -hmm. yep. then um, canned goods in the bottom one. All right. Trash can here extra storage perfect yep junk, perfect junk drawer you yeah know, everyone's gonna oh, have one have a junk drawer yeah yep. you're very neat and then if i'll just scoot up here and if you yeah. just talk loud here because i'll so, be behind you Ooh. so the bed is on linear actuators so it goes up and down um i do have a pull out ladder <gasps> this is cool. where we were at the open house you were showing yeah, me that yeah. yes and i wanted to do a, yeah and so um when it's all the way down it's uh, it goes down far enough that I can sit up straight in bed. Okay, all right. Let's yeah. do a little demo Love here. That actuator is what you called yep, it. Yep, linear, huh? linear actuators. Mm -hmm, there you are. Yep. And <laughs> so, yeah, I got my nice comfy bed. I have uh, my own. I've got a little light here. So when I read in bed or work on my pine needle baskets, I can do that. Um, I have a remote for my heater so I can turn it on and off from bed, which is great. Is that right around the corner here? here. Yeah, right, right there, and it just right. sticks on the wall right here. Yeah. Yeah. Styling every which way we look. Yeah, and and then, yeah, uh, more books because, you know, who you can't have enough books. Mm -hmm. You're a reader. I am a reader. Mm -hmm. and, then, and then, yeah, my nighttime lotion and chapstick, all mm -hmm. that kind of stuff. How often do you read? Like a book a week, a book a month? How do you do that? Um, I... I Normally would say about a book a week. Good uh, for lately you. I've been doing a lot of the audio books while I do my pine needle baskets. So um, oh, that's wonderful. Yeah. Very empowering. Yeah. yeah, because sometimes people get on the road and they're like, now what am I going to do? And I right. even thought about that, like, how am I going to fill my time? So you're not just always watching YouTube. You're doing other things. Right. I try and stay busy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good, yep. good job. And so you have more of your art up here. Um, This one is not actually mine. It was just a nice one that I found at a mm -hmm. thrift store that I liked mm -hmm. and um, I love your little yeah so this door opens and so I've got the screen there and so that's really nice when I'm laying in bed or uh, working in the art studio below I can have that door open and get some really nice fresh air wow yeah. wow yeah. and then I love your did you uh, make this no um your rainbow nope that was um my stepmom's mom made that that's beautiful yeah. it's nice to have those um homey things yeah. with you too of, mm -hmm. of other people and stuff yep and these are little um i put them in for my blackouts for my window oh i have my leftover wool insulation and then i just stitched the fabric around them and put velcro there so they just velcro right in that is fantastic yeah. fantastic and what is your bed made of um, here it's memory foam just memory foam i did cut off a little from the bottom and a little from the side just to make this fit better mm -hmm. um mm -hmm. But yeah, it's super mm -hmm. comfortable. I love mm -hmm. it in here. Very nice. Yeah. Very nice. And then and then the skylight that opens and um there has we the are. bug screen or you know the when I sleep it's got the shade. Wow. 
and it's small enough that I can actually squeeze through there and sit on the roof if I want to. <laughs> oh, and you can be one of those van dwellers like this is the life right? instead yeah. of the real deal. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> that's awesome yeah. yeah go out there with uh, yeah that's fun that's awesome so we'll uh, check out what's below here yeah, now let you come down laptop back there hanging on the wall there very very convenient yeah yes. and that way it doesn't fly around and get broken and when it's I'm right out there driving. it's yep. right going to Lindsay's art studio uh, she's gonna pull out Aston Martin's home here where he stays in his litter box and we'll get to see actually her actual art studio. Taking us into your art studio. Oh, no, come on in. All right. Below the bed here. Yeah. Look how cozy. So I have Ooh. a fold up table with um, my drawers of pens and pencils and paint brushes. Wow. And um, then I've got a bunch of different kinds of artwork down here um, stuff to do artwork with paints and alcohol inks and. Uh, fabrics. I make my own um, reusable paper towels too. So I Do have. You? Yeah. In fact, I've got a sewing machine in here with me too. Reusable yeah. paper towels. People yeah. would be all over that here. They're fun to do. I'll, I'll show you them in just a moment. Yeah, but I'm just saying you could be selling those yeah. too, girl. Yeah, they're fun to make. And then I have all these. I'm drawers. an entrepreneur, so I love what you're doing. Well, thank you. Um, and this is like extra bathroom stuff and first aid stuff, extra artwork. Where did um, you get these little containers? Amazon. They're actually for shoes. They're shoe holders. Shoe holders? <laughs> Who would have thunk? Yeah. And so I just drilled them right into my... Uh, I'll show you. This here is my electrical box and my wow. sewing machine. Wow. And so. your sewing machine yeah. back in there. You are really, really... Oh my gosh. You've got everything here. And that's a serious electrical box if you yeah. ask me. Did you put that all together too? Yes, I sure did. Okay, girl. Yeah. You've got talents beyond talents here. Thanks. Yes. And above your head is bungee with... Um, yeah, bungee with a backpack and my big, thick winter jacket, which I haven't needed out here. All right. Um, and then, like, my sh grocery bags for shopping, that kind of stuff. Okay. All um, right. And then in the corner... In the corner here is my freshwater tank. All right. Let me come around. What you were talking here. Uh, so this is my freshwater tank here, and then my freshwater and gray water hose. Mm -hmm. um, and so that's where I fill. I just open up this door here, and then I can fill it super easy. Fantastic. Yep. Oh, and, and now then, we get a view this way. Yeah. Yeah. And then here I have more storage. This pops open, and then I have um, like my seasonal clothes. So this is all my summer t-shirts mm -hmm. and shorts and. Uh, I have an extra butane stove there. You hit your head again, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be, you go. gotta be short like me in here. <laughs> this is awesome. Now we get a good view of all of this. Yeah. I am digging it. And you've got even a window view while you're working. Mm -hmm. A yeah. window in the office. Uh, this was one of mine that I made. I make the little sun catchers too. Oh, how fun. Yeah. That's excellent. Love it. Look at the mountains yeah. there. You've got yeah. a perfect spot yeah. here right now. And my ukulele and my yoga mat. All right, girl. Yeah. Yoga and ukulele too. You are a girl of many, many <laughs> talents. Wow. It all in here. This is, and I see how you've done your shoes here. I didn't yeah, see that yeah, earlier. My shoe rack is really nice too. Yeah, you attach those boards. Yeah, they're just L brackets, and I just um, put the L brackets on the bottom and just made little shelves. I love where you say just. Like to me, it's <laughs> like this is a big deal. This is really a big deal. Uh, these you've are got my, your threshold there. Yep. And then these are my reusable paper towels that I make. Wow. Yeah. And what makes them reuse? Just the. The a type of fabric? Yeah, or? but it's just the felt, so it ab absor absorbs really well. Oh, I see. Mm -hmm. Okay. All yeah. right. And then a couple more things I noticed. Yeah. Now, you said you don't always move this out, but if you're working in here... Yeah, if I work yeah. in my studio, and I can yeah. collapse it, but I do... Um, this is just his travel cage, so when we're on the road, he's in here. Okay. Um, but he has his main litter box down under here. Oh, okay. So you have a main litter down yeah, there. Yeah. I see. So All that's right. just his... All right, and then a beautiful photograph here. Yeah, that's where'd a, you get this? That's the Colorado um, sand dunes. My brother actually took that. I'm telling you, that is amazing. Thank beautiful. You. Yeah, he's an incredible um, artist. He's well, you really two good could with... get together on yeah. this. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Wow, Lindsay. Well, is there anything else that you can think of? Look how cute. Oh, yeah. 
I'm just yeah. noticing all kinds of I things. Know. Did you pick There's... this up somewhere special? Uh, I, I picked it up um, out in Arizona, actually. Yeah. Well, that's perfect. That's yeah. a perfect souvenir. Yeah. All right. Well, is there anything? I'll have you step back a oh, little. Oh, yeah, definitely. Um, no, I think I think you've seen it all. Yes. Yeah. Oh, one more thing, Kim. Oh, yeah. Always one more thing. The, uh, what, how did you do the ceiling? Um, so the ceiling and the walls are just beadboard. beadboard. <clears throat> and so I did the furring strips and then just cut sections and kind of just wrapped it and then just drilled it into the furring strips. Wow. And what kind of tools did you have to purchase for this build? That's where I was really lucky. My dad had almost all the tools that I needed. And what kind of tools did you use? I'm um, curious. I used a lot of saws, um, nothing like too weird. Um, Gosh, it's been been long enough. I put the process in the back of my head, you know. All right. Yeah. Yeah, but um. But how much money? Okay. In in our last, you said that you paid like forty five hundred, and uh -huh. it was pretty much a shell. Yeah. And then how much did you put into this? I put in so I put in about three thousand and just the engine, um, just to make sure that it was super road worthy, um, and then got new tires, so that was another eight hundred, and then the build itself 14, was thousand in the build, um. So yeah, I'm at probably overall I would say uh, about the used stores, and they just don't have a lot for plywood. Oh, I see. Yeah, All so right. a lot okay. of that I had to buy new. All right. Well, this has been quite a treat. Yeah. Really. For stopping by. Yes, I appreciate having a. I'll call you a new friend. Yeah, definitely. You know, and uh -huh. us nomads uh, never like to say goodbye. We always like to say, "See you see down you later. the road." Yep. See you down the road. And so I wish everything uh, just the best for you. And oh, I, you. I do end my videos, and this will be for you uh, personally and for the audience. Blessings in your day and joy in your journey. Well, thank you very much. I sure appreciate it. Thank you, Lindsay. Thank See you. you later. Bye.